we are what we throw away. You know, we, we exist and, and in the process of existing, we, we make waste, if you like. I started putting together a kind of empty shop. So something that's like shelves of all of the empty packaging. And I then sort of thought, well, is there a way, another way of keeping this stuff? And then I found myself thinking about maybe I could use painting. Through the process of transforming the stuff, like it, it would, it would make us more aware of that sort of quotidian amount of debris that we, that we kind of produce, if you like. Human existence is now starting to become under threat, I think, from, from the environment that, that, that human beings have actually kind of created. Art can offer a place where we can look at our culture, where we can look and think about our ideological values. I think that the, there's something happens where obviously when you recognise in the painting um, that maybe you thought was an old-fashioned painting, um, you recognise that there's a plastic bottle or that there's something um, of a container that you recognise or that's not, um, that's not historic, that somehow is contemporary. Um, you get this kind of anachronistic kind of jolt thing you're looking at isn't quite what you thought it was that you were looking at, that there's a sort of, that there's a shift in perception. And I think that, that sort of same sort of like twist in perception is something that I quite often use in my work where maybe I'd cast something in bronze and paint it to look like the thing it was before. And, and yet somehow because it's been turned through a process into something else, like when you find out about the fact that it's not what you thought it was, you start questioning like how you were, in a way like, you question your preconceptions, how you were kind of in a system of looking, in a kind of ideological space where you saw things in a certain kind of way. The show I've called The Conspiracy of Blindness, and in a way it's kind of the blindness of waste. We're in a system whereby overconsumption and, and waste and scarcity are all part of our sort of capitalistic way of being. And unfortunately, there's no real future to that. And so I think that there is, a, is an, interesting, there's an interesting kind of juxtaposition of, of painting that's taken from maybe a painting painted 100 years ago um, through to a painting that obviously realises that there probably isn't another hundred years in terms of the way that we're kind of consuming the world. Is that too heavy? <laughs>